Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. I'm the Emperor of the Universe. My Universe. Anyway, this message, hi, I love you. This message is important. I just found, I just had to delete all my subscriptions. And that's important. Because I've been on this channel for two years and I've had almost 800 videos, right? And, well, two reasons why I deleted them. Um, I started out deleting one because she, and it really sucks because I have a lot of really great readers, counsel, people that I trust and listen to to help in this battle that we're in. This is a spiritual war we're dealing with. This isn't just the 3D. We're in the 5D. We're, and it's hard. I've been fighting for the last two years and I've just figured out how to protect myself, my energy, my power, and to fight back. And it's been two years of just non-stop attacks from the dark side. And they're not done. And YouTube's a part of it. YouTube is dark hearts. They're, they're running it. They're running it. Period. And there's, there's CIA. F, I mean, there's weird shit going on. And they're infiltrating. They're, and they're in their... I know it sounds ridiculous, but yeah. The readers. I mean, these are dark hearts. You know, got to understand. They understand it. These assholes know that it's a spiritual war. And they're working hard to, to keep everybody in fear. Low vibration. And just confusion and just, you know, just not, there's no happiness in that. You have to run high vibration. It's hard to explain, but you have to love yourself and you can't be out humping and boozing, you know. You can shake your ass. There's nothing wrong with the Friday night, but you can't be just, you know, morally, you know, without, you know, bringing in any books or, you know, foundations into it. I'm talking about just, you know, respecting yourself, loving yourself, believing in yourself enough that you deserve to have an emperor or an empress at your side and not some just sleazy bimbo or fucking douchebag. You know what I'm saying? I feel my, I feel, I'm heated right now. It's not, I'm not unhappy. I'm unhappy about having to, I just had to undescribe. Plus, one of my favorite readers, I'm not even going to mention her name. It just really pisses me off. But she just recommended a fucking asshole. I was just, and it was funny because I was just thinking, I was talking to God about that yesterday because I was looking at these readers, man. I know there's a lot of bad readers out there. There's no, they're not all working for the light. There's a lot of bad readers reading tarot, and they're misleading, and they're they're pumping out the fear porn, and it's horrible, and they, they, it needs to stop. And and I I recognize it. I'm, my instincts are fucking on fire. I have a direct line to God, baby, in the universe, and I'm tapped in. And last night I was on fire. I couldn't sleep. My my third eye was just itching and flaming, and it was just it's crazy. But we're in a spiritual war, and that's another thing. Is it really pissed me off? Is is all the subscriptions I have, none of, them, none of them subscribe to me. I have almost 800 videos. And they're really interesting, a lot of them. They're just, I mean, I spent the last two years running from this, from Kobe, you know, just trying to survive and live my life and, and do, live the best life I can. Painting and showing the paintings, selling my paintings, trying to teach you how to love yourselves and, and to protect your energy. I'm talking the age of Aquarius. I'm going to write a book about it. I'm going to have to write some kind of blueprint so people understand how to act, how to react. I spent my whole life in spiritual warfare and I didn't even understand it. I was being attacked on the constant from day one. Can you imagine as an infant? I was, uh, seriously, I was protected. I have angels, powerful angels protecting me and I didn't understand that either. But they've been there the whole fucking time. And, it, and, and the weird part was it wasn't until I understood this. I was low, low vibration and I was toxic too. And I didn't, and it wasn't so much that I was toxic and low vibration. It was the people around me were low vibration. And if you're a high vibration human being to begin with, and you're nothing but surrounded by assholes, you're not going to understand and they're not going to help you. They're going to see your high vibration and they're not going to want to see you elevate and be more and leave them behind and, you know, whatever place they're in and misery and shit. So they're going to keep you down, and it's really bizarre, but that's what my whole life has been. And I just realized, I, and some of these people that I've had to unsubscribe to have been my teachers. And it's important to understand this, but I'm, I've graduated. I'm done watching other people's stuff. You're going to start watching me, because I have something to say, and I have a lot of things. I've been connecting the dots. Like I said, I have a direct line, and every time I ask a question, they tell me. And it's amazing, and it, does, it makes sense. And that's why I know when you have CIA assholes just trying to disguise themselves as fucking tarot readers. Or they're just, they're, it's evil. You know, there's, like I said, there's dark hearts and they're working hard against the light. I'm a light worker. 
I've been a light worker my whole life. I just didn't know it. And now I'm fully committed to being a light worker. I'm celibate. I don't drink. And I don't do anything to harm myself. And I'm, I'm, I'm really good at protecting my energy. Really good. I've learned the last two years, like I said, I've been in the, I've been on the battlefront in the spiritual warfare. And most people don't even understand because you're still low vibration. And like I said, I was surrounded by that my whole life. And here's the fun thing is even a low vibration human being can become a vi high vibration. It's not, there's miracles. It happens. People can change. You can change. You have to understand this though. Oh, I need to calm down. I'm so excited right now. But you have to understand you can change. If you're low vibration, if all you do is party and drink and you're ego and you're just running in the ego, it's just, it's terrible the way to be. You know, like I said, I'm going to do a blueprint so people can, maybe it'll spark something and make them realize that the way they've been living is wrong. Like toxic behavior and, and energy vampires. That's another thing. Oh my God. I've had to learn to deal with energy vampires hard. And here's the fun part is when you become in your power, you're like a beacon to these scumbags. And they come from everywhere. Like I said, my whole journey has been, I've been documenting, I've been talking about it, where I've been having, attracting these people. They were so toxic. It was like hurting my heart. And they weren't, a lot of them were just really creepy human beings. And it's like, my job was to try to change people and just, you know, counterbalance. I was told wherever I go, I would light it up. And then they would be, it would repel people. I showed up at this spot where I'm at, at Chiriaco Summit. The day I showed up, the ladies across the way were calling and talking to sheriffs. Sheriffs. A gentleman was up here. This is public land, so you can camp out here and do whatever you want for 14 days. Basically, this uh, some gentleman, some guy in an RV was claiming this is his land, threatened to kill these ladies. I showed up, and I went over there to talk to her, and the, the cop that was there, the sheriff was there. I'm like, is everything okay? What's going on, right? Because I just got there. I literally pulled up an hour before, and she told me what was going on, and I'm like, oh, really? Threatened to kill you? Okay. I was like, I'm not going to tolerate that bullshit, and I'd have it. And he's come by a couple, he comes by trying to fucking get all creepy and shit, and I'm just like, not having it. I'm the emperor of the universe. I'm, I'm divinely guided, baby. And I'm in the warfare. And I'm telling you, this blueprint's amazing for for spirituality, for your protection, for your power. Because you're you're either in it or you're either working for the dark or the light, man. And you got you pick a side. And and trust your instincts to know when people are fucking with you. And like I said, this is people low vibration human beings don't understand about magic. They don't understand about spirituality. They don't give a shit. Because it, because if they did, it would have to shine a light on all the bullshit they do. Most people are toxic and they don't want to change. They don't want to do the dark night. They don't want to do the inventory on their life. The shit that they've done that they regret and they wish they hadn't have done. And that's part of the dark night. Is And you have to forgive yourself. That's the, the best part of the dark night is once you go through it and you see all the crap you've done, you forgive yourself. Anyways, I hope this is still going because a lot of times they cut off my videos when I'm talking especially when it's a powerful message. <clears throat> and I usually don't go this long. It's been a long time since I've done long videos because they literally block them anyway. So anyway, this is important. And that's the thing is I have had this my channel for two years, growing and learning. And I have gotten shit support from any of my readers, which is really sad because I've been constantly, you know, I was, they know me. I, Cause I will sit there and say, thank you for your re time. Thank you for your counsel. I was constantly thanking and liking all the videos from my readers and none of them thanked me I mean none of them went to my site saw the 700 fucking videos none of them bothered to even want to subscribe to me I mean I'm supporting all these people's channels and none of them were supporting not one of them so fuck that right I mean I'm the emperor of the universe you either you're gonna start supporting me now you're gonna figure it out you're either gonna figure it out or you're gonna stay low vibration and, and just live in shit and misery because we're, I'm done with that shit. And I'm done watching other people live in shit and misery. And these assholes in charge. You see, how, you see how fired up I am? Well, guess what? So is God in the universe. They're pissed hard. Whenever I start getting like this, I know that they're fucking, they're, re they're revved. They're just, it's, the balance is off big time. And the bad guys are running the show. They're wanting war. They're wanting death. They're wanting destruction. These are things that I am against. I want love and light. I think we should be exploring the stars like Star Trek, not hanging out, blowing each other up, and sending more missiles to fucking Ukraine. 
See, I get heated because this is just, they're, they're, they're evil. They, they worship the dark. And I'm going to bring something up. I don't give a fuck. Planned Parenthood. <laughs> don't call it Planned Parenthood. You don't go there to be a parent. And guess who? This is the fun part. And I'm talking about spiritual warfare. Satanists are complaining because they don't want them to be shut down because that's part of their ritual. They're sacrificed to the dark lord, the fucking Satan. Okay? Yeah, this is crazy shit. But yeah, so so you know you're in the wrong, liberals, when you're you're promoting Planned Parenthood and so is Satanists. Satanism. They're, the Satanists want Planned Parenthood to kill as many babies as they can because it worships the dark. It feeds the dark. Babies are miracles. They are gifts. They are fucking light. And, and when you crush their light, it feeds the dark. Yeah, I'm heated. You can see that, right? I'm the emperor of the universe. And my job is to protect everybody, even the assholes, against themselves. So I can try to change their hearts. I can try to do miracles. But I can only do so much on YouTube right now. They're just really screwing me hard. So no more subscriptions. I'm not going to play your game, YouTube. You don't want me to be monetized. You don't want me to have me to... Yeah, you're just blocking my shit. So I'm just going to do what I got to do. I'm going to keep pumping out videos. And God willing, we're going to win. And the rest of you, I love you. God loves you and the universe is crazy about you. But the bad guys suck it. We're coming for you. Sunlight.